Hey guys, it goes YouTube. So I'm in here and I received an email and I was just going to read it out the way it came to me because I don't really think I can add anything to it. It's called A Gun Confiscation, U.S. Veterans and Second Amendment. Hi, I want to introduce myself. My name is David A. Schmeckel. Schmecker. If possible, i like to get my story known to as many people as possible. To make this brief as possible, I live in Connecticut and I am 50 years old and I am honorably discharged disabled Navy veteran. I don't have a psychiatric past or criminal past. Fe February the 5th, 2013, my Veterans Hospital primary care daughter called my home and heard a message on my answering screen. He said sounded peculiar, and the VA contacted a local police to perform a wellness check. The police came to my home without any justification whatsoever, hauled me away for a psychiatric evaluation at the local hospital. I submitted to their forceful, intensive, under duress, and fear of arrest or worse. I wasn't arrested, and no crime was committed, nor any threats made to myself or others. They confiscated my guns and my pistol permit. I was released two days later from the evaluation on my own recognizance. I have since attempted to use the courts attorneys to fight for the revocation of my pistol permit. Then on top of everything else, the bills from the short stay at the hospital and the EMS bills, they billed me and what I have to pay the attorney adds up to a large amount of money. I'm just a nobody. So there is obviously a campaign orchestrated to disarm law abiding citizens and veterans administrations have found a loophole in the system to do it because I am a nobody they feel empowered to be able to do this to me I must be the tip of the iceberg of this campaign and they are testing the waters to see what they can get away with and whom with whom they mess with my life and my rights if I wasn't hurt I could just walk away from uh, from the VA, but I utilize their benefits for all my health care needs. I am concerned about this and where the country is headed. I will put the gentleman's uh, YouTube page on there. Uh, it's Dave Nobody, really, um, if you guys want to contact him. Thank you. Oh, my God.